This is the introductory video to Athletic.net's new Excel Meet Manager Cross Country Edition. In this video, I will briefly show you around some of the features of the EMMXC. If you want to see how to run a meet, watch the video called Run a Meet. The first step in using the EMMXC is to download it from Athletic.net. Let's open up Athletic.net. As you can see on the main home page, we have this link that says Excel Meet Manager. Click that link. This brings you to the Excel Meet Manager home page. From here, we can click Download Current Version. This is the download page for the EMMXC. It will always contain the most current release for the EMMXC, this icon, or we can also download label templates that will interface with the EMMXC. Let's click the icon to download the EMMXC. We do not want to open the EMMXC. This could cause us to lose valuable meat data. Instead, we want to save it to our hard drive. We then need to choose a location to save it, where we can find it later. I've chosen My Documents and then made a folder called XC Meats. I'm also going to add in the meat name to this file. That way I can have a new EMMXC file for every single meet that I run. Click Save. After it has saved, we can click Open here. Or if we don't see this dialog box, we open Excel. Click Open and find a, find a location on our hard drive where we have saved the EMMXC. We first of all get this macros disabled warning. If you do not know how to enable macros, watch the videos called Enabling Macros. I will go ahead and, and enable them. Now I will go ahead and download a trial meet to show you around the EMMXC. This is covered in further detail in the Run a Meet video, which will show you where to find the Meet ID and key for your Meet. My Meet has now been downloaded, so we can show you around the EMMXC. There are two ways to get around the Excel Meet Manager. The first is the EMMXC menu, which you see at the top of each sheet. Here we can go to the Welcome Sheet, the Schools Sheet, the Entry Sheet, Race Setup, various race or scoring, set, scoring sheets if they have been initialized or scored, head back to athletic.net's home page, or get help for whatever sheet we are on. In addition, we have the same options down here. We can go to the schools, the entries, race setup, the help sheet, or we also have the option for the config sheet where there are several configuration settings, or the reports sheet. One quick thing I want to point out is the Quick Start Guide. This Quick Start Guide right here, which you can print by using this printer icon, will give you the bare necessities for running your meet. Now, a little more about the EMMXC. Each page will also have other options up here in the menu. If you have the printer icon, this will take you to a special template for that sheet. Example. I now have a report that is specially prepared for the schools. I can close that print preview and it takes me back to the school sheet. The refresh icon will repair any damage that you might have done to the sheet. The plus option and the overwrite option and other options you may see on other sheets will be covered in other videos. So in the EMMXC we have our schools, we have our entries, we have our races, if we are in advanced scoring mode, we also have our scoring divisions. This will be covered in greater depth in the advanced scoring video, don't worry. We have help. As you can see, we have our table of contents right here. We can always jump back to that, to that table of contents. We can go look at, for help for a specific sheet, or we can learn how to add a school, enter results, or score. We also have these online resources where we can jump to current news and info on the EMMXC. We can go to the EMM download page or we can go to the forums for more help. That is a brief introduction to the EMMXC. 
You are probably ready to run your meet now, so go ahead and watch the video called Run a Meet. Thanks and have a great day.